In this lesson, we want to start storing things onto the timeline. We'll add a loop to layer 1, set it to full opacity, and after that, we'll press Store Active in the timeline. We have a project ready with servers and content, which leads us to just selecting layer number 1, choosing and adding a loop, and then we go to the Control tab and fade up the opacity. Then we'll set it to Play Loop. We'll now position the Now pointer at a time where we want to continue working, then right-click on the time axis and we'll say Store Active. We can now see that the red active values have disappeared and that the clip appears on the timeline. If we now let the timeline run using the spacebar, we'll see that the content plays until the Now pointer reaches the end of the content.